What is the first thing you think of when you hear the words environmental engineering? Save the trees? Save the fish? Recycling? Have you ever wondered what environmental engineers do? Environmental engineering is the study of the effect of human activities on the environment and the use of engineering principles to improve and maintain the environment. The United States Environmental Protection Agency has identified 10 issues of concern in this matter. Air, water, waste, land and cleanup, health and safety, climate change, green living and sustainability, emergencies, chemicals and toxins, and pesticides in agriculture. By focusing on these issues, environmental engineers improve and maintain the environment for the protection of human health and ecosystems. Me too? Yes, you too. To see how important environmental engineers are to our life, let's look at our own daily routine. When you wake up in the morning, what is the first thing you do? You wash your face, brush your teeth, and you use the restroom. To do all of these activities, you need clean water. Environmental engineers clean river water and groundwater to provide you with safe drinking water, which you use for all your activities throughout the day. What happens to that water that you use? In a day, each of us generates 265 to 375 liters of wastewater. All of it has to go somewhere, right? All this wastewater is sent to treatment plants near your house. Environmental engineers design these plants to clean millions of gallons of water each day in order to maintain water quality of rivers and oceans. Moving on. Now that you're dressed to go to school, you go to the kitchen and eat breakfast. You throw away any leftovers and trash, cereal boxes, wrappers, paper towels. Where does it all go? The trash you generate is collected from your house and is either recycled, composted, incinerated, or buried in the landfills. There are more than 3,000 landfills in the United States that are specially engineered to hold tons of solid and hazardous waste generated by people and industries so that toxic chemicals in the waste do not pollute the soil. Okay, let's go back to your morning routine one last time. You finish breakfast and you're ready for school. You get on the school bus. You may have noticed that buses spit out smoke when they run sometimes. The smoke contains gases such as carbon monoxide, carbon dioxide, which deteriorate air quality. The air quality in your city is monitored by environmental engineers. They also make technologies to take out a lot of the harmful chemicals from the smoke so that the air is healthy, safe, and breathable. Okay, so far we've talked about how environmental engineers affect our daily life. Clean water, clean air, and no waste. Are there other ways that environmental engineers help you? Of course! Remember that environmental engineers study anything that could affect the environment and try to make the environment better. In many places, the air, soil, and water is already filled with harmful chemicals that can hurt animals or humans. Environmental engineers use advanced technologies to research treatment methods to take these chemicals out of water, soil, and air to make the environment safer for humans and animals. Another way environmental engineers help people is by improving sustainability and researching alternate energy. They closely monitor the health of the environment and study the risk posed by any natural and industrial disasters to the environment. These are just some of the ways environmental engineers help protect public and ecological health. Think about your life. What are some ways you know environmental engineers help you?